series of videos called Bluey Week. Anything that has to do with Bluey I was not sponsored with. I'm just doing this out of fun. If you don't know what Bluey Week is, Bluey Week is a series of videos that I created to get you ready for both the episode coming out this Sunday, Ghost Basket, and the episode that is 28 minutes long coming out next week on April 14th, The Sign. So, today's video is going to be a craft video, and it is to make the glasses that Bluey wears when she plays Granny Janet. And we're also going to make a little friendship bracelet to go with them. Since this weekend, the episode Ghost Basket is premiering, and it has Janet and Rita, I thought this would be a great video to begin our Bluey week. Disclaimer. If you're a kid, please get adult supervision when trying to make this crap. So, let's get into the video, and here come the grannies! Let's begin with the glasses. The items you'll need for the glasses are novelty glasses that look like flowers. These can be found at the Dollar Tree in their summer collection section. Next, you will need sandpaper. I use P80 sandpaper, a sanding block, a paint palette, water, paint brushes, an old towel that you can wipe your brushes on, and paint. I'm using Craft Smart acrylic paint in Orchid and Craft Smart multi-surface premium satin acrylic paint in Plum. I also use matte finish Mod Podge. Since Granny Bluey's glasses do not have a lens, I popped the lenses out on these sunglasses. Next, I took the glasses and I wetted them with the towel so that when I go to sand it, all the dust isn't flying everywhere. Then I took my sanding paper and I started sanding. Next, I took the sanding block to buff any of the sanding from the sanding paper to make sure that the glasses had a cleaner look. As you can see, Bluey's glasses are purple, almost like a fuchsia color, so I decided to take her glasses and I noticed that they were not like the two colors that I had, so I decided to find the pink paint, which is the Craft Smart Multi-Service Premium Satin Acrylic Paint in Pink Bliss mix all three colors together. As you can see, I began painting. What you want to do is paint one coat on and let it dry. Let it dry completely before you do a second coat. Here's what the second coat looks like. Here's the finished look before the Mod Podge. And here's the finished product with the Mod Podge. The next craft we're going to make is a Janet and Rita friendship bracelet. So, for this friendship bracelet, you will need alphabet letters, some pearl beads from the Dollar Tree, some pony beads, I got these from Amazon, and some elastic string. I wonder if Rita ever made a friendship bracelet. If she would say, I slipped on my beads! It has Rita and Janet in alternating colors of their blankets, and then beads that represent each other. So here's the end result. And here's the end. You have granny glasses and a granny bracelet to get you ready for ghost basket. If you want to see more videos that are on the horizon, please be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching!